Hey guys, it's AJ the Gamer here. I just wanted to give you guys a unboxing review of the iPod 5th generation. And as you can see, I already unboxed it. <laughs> but it's right here. It's actually pretty damn nice. And it's very, very thin. As you can see. But yeah. I'm going to show you guys what's in the box. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Fuck. <laughs> well, this is just a sticker on top. You peel it off. It comes on there. Um, this is just information on the surroundings of the iPod, I guess. Like it says here. Volume buttons. Sleep-wake button. The loop. You know, lightning connector, all that shit. And it comes with some stickers. Um, and then inside, all it comes with is the USB charger, lightning cable connector. And, um, yeah, the actual loop itself. I think it's nice, but it's more girly, to be honest, you know. I wouldn't wear it. Like I only I only used it a couple times because when I first bought this, I did not have a cover. And I was like, I am not letting this shit drop. So I used it for a little bit until I got the cover. But anyways, this is the loop. See, as you can see, let me focus real quick. See how it sticks out? Oh shit. You pop it right back in. Yep. Well, all you gotta do is simply place it like this from one side. Shit, this is hard. Hold on, guys. Alright, start from one side. Like that, and then you just pull it back, and it should be stuck good in there. See, like it's pretty good to be honest. And then you could adjust it. Hold on. Like that. So it won't be so wide open. But yeah. Yeah, I think it's more of a girly thing, to be honest. <laughs> but yeah, that's why as soon as you get this, I recommend getting a screen protector. Mine is all scratched up. I need a new one. And a case. This is the case I have. Pretty good. Cost me 15 bucks at the mall. But yeah. Anyways. It's already on. And by the way. Hold on. It has a 5 megapixel camera. Pretty nice. It's black. With the mic. And the LED flash. And then this is the... Like, I don't know what you call it. Like, it's like for the Wi-Fi, you know, or like Bluetooth and stuff, I guess. It's the iPod logo, the loop. Yep, you already got that. The volume rockers. Pretty nice. Sleep-wake button. Nothing on this side. The speakers. It's all right. Not as good as the iPhones, but it's good. Better than the iPod 4, 4th generation, then the charger, put the, the headphone, jack, whatever, fuck shit, I don't fucking know, man, anyways, I'll show you my apps, well, as you can see, I already got, you know, all the normal stuff, Facebook, Messenger, Kick, Instagram, Snapchat, Google, but I have this Word document, 
It's actually good because it's free. But it's not free on a laptop, which is stupid. Um, you could just make your own um, Word documents and email them to yourself. And you could have it done at school. And I have Dead Trigger 2. It's a pretty good zombie game. I have this dictionary. Um, the good thing about this dictionary is that you don't need Wi-Fi. You just go to the settings, set it up. And you do a quick download, and from there you could just use it without internet. So let's say you're in class, you don't feel like connecting to the internet, you're like, fuck it. Let me just pull out a word, type up a word, you know, get the definition, bam. So yeah, that's pretty good. I got this 3D tu tuning game. It's about cars. It's to pimp them out, you know, drop them and stuff. Pretty nice. I actually have a picture I'm going to show you of a car I made. I made two, but I'm going to show you one. My favorite one. This Acura. Pretty nice. I like it. It's dropped. <laughs> um... What else? What else? What else? What else? Yeah, we got Storm the Train, Storm Train, whatever. Fun Run 2. It's pretty fun. Zombieville. It's alright. And Modern Combat 5. This game is amazing. Pretty nice first person shooter game. Um, It actually costs, I think, 4 or $5. And this one is 99 cents. Zombieville. And I got this music download app. It's pretty good. It's worth it. It's better than having to go on iTunes, paying for all that shit. It actually costs $3. Very, very good. I like it. Um, yep. I got Skyland Skaters. Basically, kid on a skateboard, jumping, getting coins and shit. And this app called Mmm Fingers. It's pretty fun. It's hard actually. All right, my high score is three eighty nine. This is really fun, but it's really hard. This guy follows you. Oh shit! Ah uh, yeah, you see, I can't do it through the screen. This shit sucks. See, best high score, three eighty nine. My little brother actually got to like the 500s. I was like, what the fuck? Um, what else? I got this puzzle game. Um, Sky Guide. This cost me, I think, two or three dollars. It's actually worth it. I like it. You get to look at the stars, planets close by. It's pretty nice. Press that. You could go anywhere you want. And then it gives you information. Sirius, Star and Canis Major. And yep, all that shit, man. Pretty nice. I like it. Also, I have, I have text free. Sorry. Um. Alright, I'm gonna go through my extras. I have Swift Key. I like this app because it lets you um do what Androids do, which is swipe and it's a lot better to be honest. And I have find iPhone app. Yep, this comes in clutch because yeah. A lot of people lose their devices and they start flipping and they can't even find it. This is really good, so when you get your iPod, I suggest you just get that right away. Got emoji. Oh shit. Crunchyroll. This is like, you get to watch animes. Don't really use it that much. Um, Hill Climb. Age of Zombies. Angry Birds. iFruit for GTA. And better than it. This app is pretty fucking good. I would recommend it, especially if you if you're still in school. 
even if you're not, because VPN, um, I'm not exactly sure, but I heard it, like, one, it protects it, obviously, your internet, and I think it kind of makes it faster, I'm not really sure, but, yeah, it's easy, you just disconnect, and connect, simple as that, you don't have to even go in the settings, and the good thing is that you don't have to have it running in the background either, I like that. Oh shit. Fuck my nigga. Okay, this does not wanna work. I need a new screen protector. Way better one. And last but not least, iMovie. I actually like this because um well the only reason why I have it is because I'm planning on live streaming video games. PS3. As you can see here, I just plan on, hold on, I plan on making videos on Advanced Warfare, maybe Black Ops 2, Grand Theft Auto 5, those are my favorite games, I got more, I got Modern Warfare 3, I got way more up there, um, but yeah, those are my favorite, but anyways, since I don't have a capture card, I can't even, you know, stream good HD but this you could pretty much record it and then you could zoom in actually into like so it could the screen fits exactly the size of the TV I guess if you know what I mean but yeah that's that's it yep that's pretty much it and actually now they have a new update I'm about to update it Checking for update. All right, iOS 8.2 for the iPod fifth generation, and this is a 32 gig. I don't know if I already said that, but yeah, pretty good. I like it. It's worth it. It's actually cheaper now. So if I was you, if you're looking to have maybe something for school or maybe something to bring around if you get bored, play video games. Because everybody knows the Apple Store has way better games than Android. Some are the same, but some, like, they don't even have, so, yeah. But, yeah, I guess that wraps it up. And I have this case, actually. It cost me 15 bucks at the mall. It's pretty nice. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's see? You can see you got the PlayStation 3 here. Yep. Alright. Leave a like, subscribe, do whatever the fuck you want. Peace.